you fit what your skin needs. It's going to be serum and serum only. Um, we are constantly looking for brands and products to introduce to the market, but I have yet to found something that are as good as this brand. Hello everyone! In case you're wondering who is this girl is always up here sharing about her own skincare tips, I realized that I haven't really did a proper introduction about myself for people who actually doesn't know me that well. So my name is Shin and I've been working in the beauty industry and beauty has always been a passion that I knew I would like to pursue from the very beginning and I am in the beauty industry already. Having that chances of getting to know the brands and the science and technologies behind the products, I thought it would always be a good idea to share with more people from an insider perspective. Not necessarily from beauty guru or like, I don't know, influencers, reviews. It's just that it happens to be, this is my greatest passion. I do have more chances to learn about the products and technologies, hence it explain why I'm doing this video. So today's video is about how to use different types of serum in order to achieve a flawless skin. I started my skincare routine by just applying serum, not focusing so much on the moisturizer because I thought at the time I thought I was young and Malaysia is so humid. I guess there would be quite a number of people I still think that way that if you are living in Malaysia, you don't necessarily need a moisturizer. But anyways, if you would like to know more about moisturizer, I did have a separate video that I did previously explaining how good this moisturizer is. So if you're interested, you can always click that. So before I actually know the importance of moisturizer, as I say, as I thought that I'm living in such a humid country, I don't necessarily need another layer of skincare. Serum has always been the part where I mix and match the most. It's something that I will never skip. I mentioned in the facial cleanser videos, our skin needs different things from time to time. You do need to feed your skin according to what it wants, according to the mood. So today we are only going to review uh, this brand skin though only. The reason being is because, like I said, over the course of three years, well, my company are constantly finding different um, brands to introduce to the market. I'm yet to actually discover anything that are doing as good as this brand. So it's not that I'm being paid or whatever, or it's not this mutually not biased. So I can find something that is that can replace the product I'm about to introduce. But sadly, I haven't found any. So I'm still sticking with it. So Skin Door is a brand from Spain. It has about 15 years of experience already. It is actually one of the top professional brands in Spain. So today I'm just going to share about when you should use what serum and why you shouldn't just have one serum to be incorporated into your skincare. So most of the time, um, hydration would be the basic thing that everyone needs regardless of what kind of skin condition you're going through right now. Just because water makes up 70% of our body so you you always need hydration i've made a separate video about the ingredients and how good it is about this particular serum you can click to watch that i think that will be in more detail but today i'm just going to be covering when you should use what serum and why do we need so many serum and how do you differentiate between this different type of serum okay i repeat the serum for many many times so first of all hydration will always be one of the things that you would use most of the time so when i would use this is basically most of the time when my skins are having some sort of irritations i'm having some pimples breakouts when i would like to bring back my skin into its normal state i will always use the hydration serum to begin with if you're really new to skincare or you wondering what you should start with hydration is definitely that one thing that everyone should go for this is a no-brainer so if you want to step up your skincare routine or you are above the age of 25 you should actually maintain your youth as early as possible this is when you should use um, an anti-aging serum and I have here Bubble Lips Serum okay this is actually the mini curl size I have finished the actual size I bought to you with my own monies not sponsored when I use this the key differences when I observe as compared to the hydration one is my skin will become a little bit more plucked and glowy, of course lifted. So while all of the anti-aging serum will claim that they can actually help lift it and whatnot, uh, I'm not quite sure how uh, this serum actually does and what are the technology behind it. But the specialty of this serum is it basically has this patented project in technologies where it will help to lift your muscle and anti-gravity. So while I was experimenting this serum, how I noticed it really does work is when my colleagues actually compliment me that I my face looks sharper. But I clearly knew that over that period of time, I did not lose any weight and I wasn't on any diet. But it was just because of this serum that I used, my face actually looks more um, lifted and I think more sharp. And it is all just because of this serum. 
I really loved it. I gave it to my mum one bottle as well and she can also see the differences. But the only downside of it, it is it is slightly on the pricey side. I think if I were to say one thing that is bad about this brand is about the price. Um, other than that, I would say efficacy wise, it is really really on point. Next, we have this Derma Peel Pro. I would use this twice only in a week when I would like to do my own extractions. Like, I usually do it on the weekend. It's because this is essentially a concentrated serum that is filled with enzyme to help you slough off all the dead skins and also resurfacing your skin surface. So if you're having a very sensitive skin right now or your skin is thin in general, when you apply this, you could actually feel some tangling sensation but that's actually very normal for myself i don't feel that much i feel slightly tangling but it's totally bearable while i'm using this syrup so when your face looks particularly dull or i don't know even though i'm actually in the beauty industry i'm actually pretty bad in observing key significant difference of the before after all the results but, but with this every time when i woke up and wash my face i would feel like how come my face looks like instantly brighter and like a lot more clear the other day? I realized it's whenever I use this serum, the next day I will always see that my face is so much more clearer and brighter. Of course, when it comes to serum like this, which has high concentrate in enzyme, you are not supposed to use it on a daily basis. So twice in a week, I think it's sufficient enough. So when I would avoid using this is when my skin are a little more dry, when my skin have patches or it's peeling, I would definitely avoid using this. But other than that, when my skin are normal, I would also switch up the other serum that I have for a brighter skin appearance. Last but not least, we have this Power C Serum. So, so vitamin C is actually a great ingredient for antioxidant. So what that is it meant by antioxidants is because of how polluted our current environment is regardless if you are working indoor or outdoor, that's even worse. We wanted to make sure that all the pores were clean and they have sufficient oxygen supply in order to have a better mood circulation so that it appears the glow from within. Obviously there are a lot of vitamin C products in the market but not all the vitamin C product has that kind of stabilization because it is something vitamin C is an ingredient that it can be oxidized very quickly so you wanted to find a vitamin C product that is not harmful to your skin like that's not too strong at the same time it is very stable where you can use it safely over the course of six months at least but to be honest personally this product doesn't work as well on my skin I don't see a very huge difference but with my other colleagues who have been using this for a while a lot of them actually love it but this will then be my top recommended product for this range but if you're actually in the search for vitamin C serum I would also highly recommend this brand. So as a conclusion, if you're new to this brand, the entry serum would be this PHA booster. As simple as because it is a need for everyone and because of how concentrated the hyaluronic acid is, how gentle the formulation is, even if you're having skin with eczema, it is safe to use this as well and you can see the instant calmness on your skin. So this is definitely a no-brainer. If you never tried this brand, you should definitely try Booster first. But something that is a little bit of an underrated one is this Pupil because of course there is exfoliator product that I that is some scrub that I use time to, from time to time. But for some reason I think it's because of the formulation, it can never achieve that kind of brightness as this serum can achieve. So this two would actually be my top recommended product for a very clear and bright skin. But of course, if your budget allowed, if you have, if you really do want it to maintain youthness, plumpness, always go for this global lid. This is pretty good as well, just beside the fact that it is a little bit more pricey. I would totally recommend this two to begin with. Thank you so much for sticking around and thank you so much for watching i hope that you know when to use which serum in order to achieve a better and clearer skin i'll see you guys next time